It's a free space. No. <laughs> <laughs> Come And now for our feature presentation. Everybody, it is now time for me to do my redemption on the Jeopardy Deluxe Edition for the DOS, which if you saw I came out in last place with $199, but this will be the game where I will make a comeback. And I'm being joined by Jay and Robo once again. Hey people. Hello. And for the rest of you out there watching, hello kitties and caddies. Toolbox. Ooh, eggs. Do you eat one of my eggs? Mm -mm, mm mm. Open up. Ah, ah, ah. These are not Joanna eggs. <laughs> Here we go. There's Hunter. Virginia, she's a tour guide, and Dolores Young from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, who's a restaurant manager. And our categories are, for round one, the Jeopardy round, 20th Century America, First Family Trivia, Biblical birds, Ugh. dogs, college sports, and finally, quotes. Hey, uh, Jay. Okay. Jeez. For my occupation in this game, I put that I was a gynecologist. America for 100, please. <laughs> Humorist who said his ancestors didn't come over on the Mayflower, they met the boat. Uh, who is Will Rogers? Yep, I put that I was a gynecologist. Who is Will Rogers? Right. Got it. Okay, I'll take uh, 20th century um, America for 200. Flying a jet fighter in 1953, Jay Cohorn became the first woman to fly faster than the speed of this. What is, a uh, sound? 
Yes. All right. Let's take 20th Century America for 300. An acre of England where the Magna Carta was signed was given to the U.S. in 1965 in his memory. Uh, who is, uh, King John? No. Dang it. <clears throat> Dolores, who was Henry VIII? No. No, that's Henry VIII. Oh, JFK. John F. Kennedy. Okay. Let's go to 20th Century America for 400, please. <laughs> Charles Evan Hughes resigned from this body in 1916 to run for president, but was reappointed. What is the Senate? Oops. No. Not the Senate. The Supreme Court. Oh boy. Okay. Twenty Century America for five hundred. A book by Paul Samuelson is the standard text for this college class in many countries. Oh, economics. Economics. Okay. So we'll go on. I will take uh, First Families for 100. Well, the daily double, but I can risk up to 500, so that's what I'll wager. Before the 1988 election, she joked that if George lost, she'd get a facelift and dye her hair red. Who's Barbara Bush? some cash. First family trivia for 200, please. Frederick Dent, Ellen Marshall, Jesse Root, and Ulysses, Ulysses, Simpson, Ulysses Simpson were his children. Uh, who is Ulysses S. Grant? Right. Okay, let's go with uh, first family trivia for 300, please. First lady who was born Claudia Alta Taylor. Who is uh, Lady Bird Johnson? Yes. Have first families for four hundred, please. First family trivia, rather. His wife, Rachel, lived to see him elected, but died before he was inaugurated. Kathy rings in. Who is Andrew Jackson? Right. We go on. Okay, first thing is private. Welcome back. Welcome back. The first White House wedding took place in 1812, and this first lady's sister, Lucy, was the bride. Uh, who was uh, Abigail Adams? Who? Oh. Yep. By the way, hey, Robo. Yeah? For this game, as my occupation, I put that I was a gynecologist. A what? Gynecologist. Yes. I just decided to be funny and a little off humor, so. <laughs> Here we go. Where are we going now? College Sports 100. Kirk Thomas, Jim Hartung, and Mitch Gaylord were all around NCAA champions in this sport. 
Uh, what is, hmm, what is football? No. Dang it, now I have no money. Dolores, what is gymnastics? Right. Darn. All right, Dolores, go again. Uh, dogs are So the city is now known as Beijing. This dog is a, called a Beijingese. What is a Pekingese? Right. <clears throat> I'll go with the dogs for 200. Small dog with a short nose or a short nose on a person. It's a pug. A pug. Okay. I'll go with the dog for three hundred, please. Dark dog, dark tongued doggy, whose name is a synonym for food. What is a chow? Correct. I'll go with um, dogs for 400. Originally from Canada's Newfoundland province, this dog is now a real go getter. A Labrador Retriever. Labrador Retriever. Okay. Dogs for 500, please. It's also called the Barkless Dog of Africa. What is the Basenji? And I think that is right. Okay. College sports for two American Indian game whose name means hooded stick. What is lacrosse? Right. Okay, uh, 300 plays for uh, uh, college sports. From 1964 to 75, this team, coached by John Wooden, won a record 10 NCAA basketball championships. What is UCLA? You are correct. Yeah! In the lead now. College sports for 400, please. Hubie Brooks, Bob Horner, and Reggie Jackson played college baseball at this school in Temp. What is Temp State? No. You fail. And Kathy doesn't know. You fail. It's Arizona State. Arizona State. Okay, uh, Kathy, still your turn. College Sports for 500. Oh no, my turn. College Sports 500. Excuse me. A crew race in 1852 between these two Ivy League schools was the first collegiate athletic contest. What are Harvard and Yale? Right. $1,400. I have $1,000 more than Dolores now. Okay. 
Let me have a biblical bird for 100. When Noah sent it out to see if the waters had subsided, it came back with a thin olive branch. What is a dove? You are correct. Okay, let's go with, um, let's go with, um, biblical birds for 200. Peter denied three times that he knew Jesus. After this immediately happened, what is the cock crowed twice? You are correct. The biblical birds for 300. <clears throat> Jesus' love for Jerusalem was like this mother bird gathering its little ones under its wing. What is the dove? No. Ugh. No. What is the hen? Welcome back. Biblical birds for Bird God called foolish because it lays its eggs on the ground where they can be stepped on. What is the ostrich? And I think that is correct. You are correct. Okay, quotes for 100. We must be the great arsenal of democracy, he said in a fireside chat on December 29, 1940. Who was Franklin Delano Roosevelt? Right. I'll have quotes for 200. Twain said, Adam did not want the apple for the apple's sake. He only wanted it only because it was this. What is forbidden? You are correct. Quotes for 300. In this show, Adelaide Lam laments, a person can develop a cold. What is Oklahoma? No. You fail. What is guys and dolls? Correct. Quotes for 400. On the Cuban Missile Crisis, Dean Rusk said, We're eyeball to eyeball, and the other fellow just. What is blinked? <clears throat> Two clues left. Okay, uh, quotes for 500. Birth of a Nation star who said in 1987, Hollywood has turned into an emotional Detroit. Who is, uh, Douglas Fairbanks Sr.? Or Douglas Fairbanks Jr.? No. No. George Burns? Uh-uh. <clears throat> no. Lillian Gish. I think that's the one. Correct. 
We have one clue left for $500, and that's in the category of biblical birds. Let's look, let's look at it now. When the Israelites asked Moses for meat, God provided thousands of these stout birds. What were morning doves? Quail. So at the end of the Jeopardy round, I'm leaning with 1,500, Dolores 1,000, Kathy minus 700, so she'll go first. <laughs> Let's look at the categories. They are colors, people, Insects, Massachusetts, D in literature, and finally, quotes. We have quotes in the Jeopardy round. I think these will be different in Double Jeopardy, so let's start with Kathy. People for 200. <laughs> Discovered by Bob Hope in 1949, this ballad king went from, soon went from rags to riches. Uh, who is, uh, Tony Bennett? Right. Yes. Yeah. I'll tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take a quick break, so that way I can transfer the video real fast, and then when we come back, we'll finish up Double Jeopardy and do Final Jeopardy as well, to see if I redeem myself. Don't go away. Okay, everybody, time to pick up where we left off. I'm going to go with people for 400. Pen name of Lafayette Hubbard, who died in 1986 after spending years in seclusion. Who is L. Ron Hubbard? That's it. Okay. Let's go with um, people for 600. In her first 20 years, her face graced the cover of People magazine more than any other. Who is uh, Elizabeth Taylor? No. Who is Princess Diana? You are correct. Yep, she's the one. Alright, now uh, Massachusetts for 200. Tourists visit this town to see the home of Nathaniel Hawthorne and the Witch House. manners, whoever cut one. Salem. Come on, who did it? Let's use the 400. Majestic Mount Greylock, the highest point in the state, is in these hills. Who just cut one? Who just cut one? Who just cut one? Someone please confess. Never mind, let's keep going. Alright, uh, insects are 200. All workers in an ant colony are this sex. What is female? You are correct. Yay. Okay, I'll go with um, insects for 400. The insect saying, this insect saying, when you wish upon a star to Pinocchio, who is Jiminy Cricket? Correct. <clears throat> Insects for 600. Mm -hmm. 
These regal bees sometimes fight until one stings the other to death. What are queen bees? Right. All right. Insects for 800. The most formidable of man's insect foes is this ubiquitous, ubiquitous musca domestica. What is the house fly? Right. And I'll have insects for a thousand. Appropriately named largest North American wasp, which hunts tarantulas like a bird of prey. Uh, what is the tarantula hawk? Right. Telephone. It's me, Ron. Yeah. Hola. You're about to go to work. I know, I know. I know. Oh, well, that's fine. Right. Do what you have to do. That's okay. Besides, the, the guys on Skype will keep me company while you're at work. Oh, yes, they will. Oh, and by the way, uh, Freddy got fingered. Yeah, so that way they can see how god-awful it is. <laughs> It is. Right. But don't worry. Because it's on my guilty pleasures list. I know. Yeah, Tom Green. Oh, by the way, I just got my VHS to DVD converter. Not yet. I'm going to test it out as soon as I finish this game of uh, Jeopardy I'm doing. Jeopardy Deluxe for the DOS. I'm doing my redemption. Alrighty. I love you too. Always am. Exactly. Hmm? Mm mm. Nah, nah. That's it. No, not yet. Exactly. That's what I said. Sure. Uh, no reason. It's all good, though. I love you, too. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. That's it. Bye-bye. Love you, too. Uh, Viron won't be joining us for movie night tonight, guys. Okay. She's working 6 to 10, and then she said afterwards she's going straight to bed. So tonight, it's going to be just us. Alright, that seems good. Unless, yeah. uh, uh, unless Hunter comes back. Is he there, by the way? Oh, he is. Okay. So it's just us three. Us four, I mean. It's you three and myself. Okay. In the meantime, I'll take Dean Leadership for 800. We doubt if Maul Flanders would have relished reading his Journal of the Plague Year. Uh, who is Corey Lawrence? Ugh. Yeah, right. Exactly. Charles Dickens. Oh, it's not Charles Dickens, so you fail. Who was? She doesn't know. Oh. Okay. Well, gentlemen, 
Who is Daniel Defoe? I think after we finish this game, we'll test it out. I agree. Yeah. Okay, I'll go with uh, D in literature for a thousand. He never finished his novel, Natochka Nezvanova, because he was sent to Siberia. Who is Henry Lee? Yeah, right. Just kidding. Fyodor Dostoevsky. So for that, Hunter, what do I get? Correct. You are redness. You get redness and redness rankings. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Quotes for 200. W.S. Gilbert coined the phrase, he uses language that would make your hair do this. Fall out. Oh. You fail. What is a uh, stand up? Oh. No. Okay. Uh, back to people for 800. This heavyweight Italian tenor doesn't like to sing until he's found a bent nail on the stage. Who is uh, Luciano Pavarotti? That's it. Yep. And I'll have people for a thousand. Where are your manners? Ooh, daily double. Okay, so I have 6,500. Let's go for 1,500 on this one. His wife, Leona, was a self-made millionaire before she became queen of his hotels. Yes. Who is Conrad Hilton? No. No, Harry Helmsley. Okay. So I'm down to five thousand dollars, but I still have the lead. Okay. Quotes for four hundred. The Duke of this place, Napoleon's nemesis, called his own soldiers the scum of the earth. What is Waterloo? <laughs> No? I thought for sure it would be. Oh, Wellington. Ow! Okay, quotes for 600. He said, people have got to know whether or not their president is a crook. Who is Richard Nixon? I am not a crook. That's it? Yes. Quotes for 800. Leonardo da Vinci claimed this family created and destroyed me. Who are the Capulets? You fail. Who are the Medici? Oh yeah, that was my guess. That's it. Quotes for a thousand. Vivian Lee said of this role, I knew it was a marvelous part, but I never cared for her. Oh, oh, who's Scarlett O'Hara? Right. Well, that just leaves the colors category. Let's take the $200 clue. Umber came from Terra Dumbria, the Earth of Umbria, in this country. 
Uh, I'm going to say, what is Italy? Right. Callers for 400. Shade of purple or the fruit mentioned in the rhyme Little Jack Horner. What is a uh, plum? Right. Callers for 600. The Random House Dictionary says to get this color, roast raw sienna in a, in a furnace. Kathy says, what is brown? And I know that's right. Oh, oh no, it's not. Oh, okay, why don't I try what is orange? Sienna? That's it. Okay. Eight hundred. Something intermediate in character or position falls in the area of this color. What is gray? And the last clue is all hers because it's the other daily double. She's gonna go 900. That'll take her to 3300 if she answers correctly. Here's the clue. A shade of blue is named after this 18th century English potter who used it on his ceramics. What is, who is Joshua, Josiah Wedgwood? That's it. Yep, she got it. <clears throat> so at the end of Double Jeopardy, she has 3,300, Kathy 100, and me 6,200. Here is today's final Jeopardy category. Today we're going to be dealing with horses. And I'd like to do $401. Kathy has wagered. Dolores has wagered. <clears throat> Here's the clue. Final Jeopardy answer is... It's the leading horse-raising country in the world. What is the United States? China? I said, what is the United States? No, it's what is China, so I dropped down to 57.99. Kathy got it right. She wagered everything. She goes to 200. Did Dolores say what is China? I wasn't paying attention. No, she said what is Argentina, so I end up winning the game. I've redeemed myself. Yay, redemption. With $5,799. Redemption is sweet. Yes. So that is going to do it for this game of Jeopardy Deluxe Edition for the DOS, in which my one game winnings total is $5,799, and we'll see y'all for that second game coming soon. Wrong! Wrong! Ah! 69. Four. 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 Jackie, the ass.